हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम अगेन दिस इज द पार्ट सेकेंड ऑफ क्लॉक एंड इन द प्रीवियस सेशन वी हैव डिस्कस्ड सम बेसिक कॉन्क्लूजन्स एंड अ बेसिक क्वेश्चन ऑन हाउ टू फाइंड आउट द एंगल बिटवीन मिनट एंड एंड आवर एंड इन दिस सेशन टू वी विल डिस्कस द सेम पैटर्न क्वेश्चन ऑफ फाइंडिंग द एंगल बिटवीन आवर एंड एंड मिनट हैंड टू मेक आवर कंसेप्ट क्लियर एंड स्ट्रॉन्ग सो लेट स्टार्ट फर्स्ट फर्स्ट लेस अंडरस्टैंड द क्वेश्चन एट वट एंगल द एंड ऑफ ए क्लॉक आर इंक्लाइन एट फिफ्टीन मिनट्स पास फाइव ही इज आस्किंग अस दैट वेन द क्लॉक शोज फिफ्टीन मिनट्स पास फाइव वट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ फिफ्टीन मिनट्स पास फाइव इट मीन्स आफ्टर फाइव फिफ्टीन मिनट्स मोर दैट इज फाइव फिफ्टीन फिफ्टीन मिनट्स पास फाइव आफ्टर फाइव फिफ्टीन मिनट्स मोर डेट्स what means 15 minutes past 5 so we have to find out the angle between hour and and minute hand when the clock shows 5 15 so how to calculate let's see first we are discuss to basic conclusion that one hour and it means the hour end makes an angle of 30 degree when it travels one hour okay and minute minute hand travels 6 degree in one minute hour end travels 30 degree in one hour and minute hand travels 6 degree in one minute so we had discussed this previous uh, session we have to remember this now step 1 is convert the whole into hours i have 5 hours and 15 minutes i have to convert 15 minutes into hours what is the procedure of converting minute into hours just divide it by 60 so 5 hours 15 by 60 hours now it is purely in hours why because we divided 15 minutes by 60 to convert minute into hours we divide by 60 because 60 minute is equal to 1 hours and 1 minute is equal to 1 by 60 hours so when we have to convert minute into hours we just divided by 60 so now 15 by 60 Fifteen one zero, four zero. It means five one by four. It is in the mixed fraction. Convert it. Five into four twenty. Twenty plus one twenty one by four. Now twenty one by four hours. Okay. Um. We know that one hour. In one hour. The hour end moves by thirty degree. So in twenty one by four hours. it will move by 21 by 4 into 30 degree that is that much means then it 15 and 2 so what this value indicates this value indicates the travel of hour end 
the travel of our end from this point to something here that angle is okay so now now we find the we found the angle for our end we have find the we have to find the angle for our end that much angle will be travel by our end from this to this point okay we always have to take this point as a reference so from reference point the angle travel by our end is 315 by 2 degree now we have to find out the angle travel by minute hand how much minute 15 in 15 minutes we know that in 1 minute the minute hand travel 60 degree so in 15 minute it will travel 15 into 60 degree and that is 900 degree sorry hmm 900 degree it's 60 90 degree sorry uh in 1 minute the minute hand travel 60 degree so in 15 minute it will travel 90 degree 15 into 6 90 degree now this angle is given as 90 degree we have to find out which angle this angle why at what angle the ends of a clock are inclined at 15 minute past 5 he is asking bit angle between minute and minute hand and hour hand now the hour hand at is this point and minute hand is at this point so we have to find out angle between them this is the angle between them okay how can we find out this angle we know this angle whole we know this angle so this angle minus this angle will be this angle what i mean to say is 315 by 2 minus 90 degree will be this angle 315 minus 180 on 2 and that is 135 by 2 if we change it in mixed fraction then it will be 671 by 2 67 into 134 plus 1 35 by 2 so that will be our answer actually it is it is just a 20 second job i explained it that's why it, it is looking uh something tedious so what we have done we have to find out the angle between hour end and minute hand at 515 first we convert the whole into hours to convert minute into hours we divide it by 60 so we divide 15 by 60 that is 1 by 4 and when we change it when we change the mixed fraction into normal fraction that is 21 by 4 hours 1 hour the uh, hour end travels 30 degree in 1 hour so it will travel 21 by 4 hours in Thirty degree in one hour, so that much degree in twenty one by four hours. How we calculate? We just multiply it by thirty degree. So our end from the reference point will travel thin fifteen by two degree. Now we have to find out how much minute hand minute hand will travel. 
in one minute minute hand travel 6 degree so in 15 minute it will travel 90 degree we have to find out this angle so from 315 by 2 we minus 90 degree and we get the required angle which is 67 1 by 2 degree thank you friends